Oh boy, look at what we have here. People have been going absolutely crazy out of their ever-loving minds for the Art Krispies things. And here we have an Art Krispies throw blanket. Spirits open, let's go! <laughs> Pick me up in an hour. All right, guys, today we are in Fairlawn, Ohio, about to go into this spirit Halloween right back here. Is that it right there? I can't see because the sun is in my eyes. Yes, I believe it is. And the funny thing about this right now is that that other Nate guy literally was just here 10 minutes ago. I got here. He got here. Basically the same time, only I was eating lunch. Otherwise, we could have tag teamed up in this piece. Oh, my gosh. I just cannot even believe how crazy bright it is out here today. I'm not even sure I got the right picture for my thumbnail. All right, I'll take one from right here just in case. Look at this. They have so many posters on the front windows. I don't think I've seen a store with this many posters. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten posters on the front windows here, guys. I love that. <laughs> All right, that other Nate guy says this is a pretty good store. Thank you, Automatic Doors. So let's go on in and check it out. Yes, it's always awesome walking right into a Spirit Halloween store. Wow, this is big and wide and open too. And look right up here in the front, guys. What do you see that's kind of peculiar about this one? Hmm? We have the Shack Attack, but he's on the right side and ghost faces on the left how crazy is that you know it's funny because like as many times as i've seen ghost face he just doesn't look like he's moving right to me it seems like he's supposed to move back and forth but i also could be wrong let's go ahead and get him going here here we go mr ghost face come on now yeah okay it's just his head that moves until he starts the stabbing motion and does the handshake of death. All right, Shack Attack. Let's see if we can get him going and see if we can see what happens on his chest a little bit better here. All right, come on now. Here we go. All right, come on now. Yeah, I, I'm still in search of him inside a store where I can actually see what's happening on his chest. I can just barely see it right there. The other thing that I did notice was, look at that stash. He has a very furry mustache. <laughs> okay, let's see. What do we want to look at in here, guys? We always look at the animatronics, and that's cool because people want to see the animatronics. But we got to look at some other things in here today as well. We got Towering Tallulah over here. Let's go ahead and do the Wheel of Fate quick before we do anything else. Will I live? Will I die? What's going to happen here? Okay, come on now. Come on now. One eye! Wow, look at this, guys. They have got a billion animatronics for sale on the floor here. Let's just take a look at them. First off, we have The Keeper. Now, I think I said it in the last store where I saw him. I expected his box to be so much bigger. It's such a tiny little box here for a $400 prop, but that could be because he's a tiny little guy with tiny little feet. <laughs> we got the Scream animatronic below him, and look at this. Right side by side so we can do a comparison, we have the other ghost face right here. They call him an animatronic, but he's not really an animatronic. This one is an animatronic. This one is not an animatronic. This one actually does animatronic things. This one just kind of lights up and makes noises. Both are very cool. Cool, but I think if I were going to get one, I would go ahead and get the animatronic. All right, let's see. Oh, look at this. We got a cauldronus over here, guys. Very cool. I think I've seen her for sale in one other store this season so far. We got a demonic gatekeeper over here. Whoa, we got a deadly creeper here. I haven't seen him for a while. We got two cotton candy dams on the bottom. Look at this. We have the blood of death on the floor. If I was working at this store, I would totally make a tape outline of a body there. We got a max straw down here. Look at this, guys. We got all kinds of awesome stuff in here. We've got a rat girl right here on the top. And honestly, her box is a little bit smaller than what I expected, too. We've got a Cerberus down here, the three-headed dog. We got a Wanda Webworth on the bottom. Over here, we got a Slim. I don't know if I've seen him in any stores this season. We actually have a black 
heart here as well. Oh my gosh, we have three howling spirits here. Look at this whole plethora of sitting scarecrows. Look, we got some regular sitting scarecrows. We got some scary sitting scarecrows. And then we got this guy on the other side, Toothy the Clown. I've seen him in about three stores, I think, so far. Man, they have enough swinging props. They could do an entire evil playground. The evil schoolyard. Here we got man's possessed friends. How many of these do we have? Dang. One, two, three, four, five Bubbas. I want to see a front yard hunt where it's nothing but Bubbas. Like a hundred Bubbas. And as you run through, they're all jumping out trying to get you. We got two Gordos on this end. A uh, Emmeline on the bottom. And look who is on the top here. This disgusting. Disgusting chick. Reagan from The Exorcist. Too evil. And we are not finished yet. Holy crap, look at this. We got a Grave Watcher here. We have two Dagger Mike. We got a Max Straw. Looks like we got one, two, three fogging skull piles. Look at this. We even have a collector's minion on the top here. And then we got a Barnaby the Bear and a Wanda Webworth in this pile. And down on this end, we have a straw man and the groundbreaking worm from a nightmare before Christmas. A nightmare. The nightmare before Christmas. Of course, we have the plethora of jumping spiders over here. I see blacks. I see black and reds. I see grays. We have a gray jumping spider here. Do we have a brown? I don't see any brown jumping spiders. Yes, I do. There's one right down there. Brown jumping spider. One right in the middle of all the rest. All right, we're going to walk through the fun house of terror and go down that way in just a minute. Or maybe we'll come back up this way because I forgot. I noticed there's another pile of animatronics up here. If I weave through here, take a right and then take a left. Here is another pile right here. We got a Bobby Strings. We have a Barnaby the Bear. Look at this. We have two demonic gatekeepers on the bottom here, two night terrors over here, and two gravestone ghouls. Oh, it looks like they only have a very limited selection of the tumblers. I think this one is one of the coolest ones, though. In space, no one can eat ice cream. I don't think I've seen this one before, though. Look at this. It just says dead. Wait a minute. Here's some things I don't think I've seen. These Snuggies. This is a Chuggy Snuggy. Ch I called him Chuggy. What the heck? Chucky Snuggy. And actually, I messed up because I was reading that word. Snuggaroomy, which I think I have seen these now because I remember that word. We got Nightmare on Elm Street. Freddy Krueger Snuggaroomy. Oh my gosh, we got a bunch of them over here. Look at this. We got Patrick Star. We have Beetlejuice. Here we go, we got SpongeBob. I should buy that one. I'm such a big guy, this would probably be just like a regular hoodie for me. And we've got Scooby Dooby Doo. Oh boy, look at what we have here. People have been going absolutely crazy out of their ever loving minds for the Art Krispies things. And here we have an Art Krispies throw blanket. That's one I haven't even seen a picture of online. And they actually have two. And I noticed that because I was looking at these slippers over here because people have been saying that there are actually Art the Clown slippers, but I haven't seen those yet either. There's a Goosebumps throw up there I wouldn't mind having. I do not see the Art plush in this store, but I do see this awesome Spongebob backpack. Are you ready, kids? All right, before I forget, let's start dropping some stickers in the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket. Wait, it didn't go into the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket. <laughs> let's leave a couple here for the night terror. Oh, look at this. I don't think I've seen the groundbreaking skeleton yet. I've seen the groundbreaking pumpkin, and I've seen the purple-haired spinning eyes clown, but I don't think I've seen the groundbreaking skeleton. Look at this. We have a whole plethora of killer creatures here. Oh, no. Killer critters is what they're called. We have scabs. Where's your best friend? Is your best friend here? What the heck? Scabs' best friend, Carrot, is not here. We have Steven Seagull. We have another Scabs here. We have a whole bunch of secret-keeping cats. Do you know where Carrot is? And we have some zombie squirrels here, as well as this guy right here. This one is just so strange to me. A skull on the back of an ugly slug. Look at those eyes. 
Hello, lady. We got two hookhead hogs, but I don't see any hook eye guys over here. Here's some more swinging fellows for our evil playground. They are pretty stocked with the inflatables today, though, guys. Check this out. They actually have two of the 12 foot ghost faces. I have one of those at home. And they have two of the Jack the Reaper archways. They got stuffed dummy props and these hanging fellows and this hanging lady. This one just looks like she would bite your arm off if you let her. Ah! Oh, look at this. We got three of the hanging Jack Reapers. Wow, I'm surprised you can even find this guy in stock because he's so awesome. Hello, sir, with one eye. Oh my gosh, here is a grandpa mask I have never seen. Look at the hair on that guy. It's a reverse mohawk. We've got the zombie babies, but none of them that I haven't seen. And guys, I actually saw pumpkins for sale at a store yesterday, and I almost bought one so I could carve it. Maybe I'll do that tonight. Let's just take a look at some of these masks real quick here. I don't see anything else that I haven't seen, but I do like this guy who has 1,000 eyes. All right, you guys tell me, which of these skeletons do you like better? The regular ones here or these colored ones over here? Wait a minute, there's a third color. This one actually has eyes that turn on and move. I have him turned on, but his eyes aren't actually moving right now. But yeah, check that out. I like that. We have like the tan colored one here. We have the darker one that looks like he's been rotting for a while. And then we have this one that's just been cleaned of all the flesh. They have the Sam and Ghostface Porch Buddies. Lots of good guys. We got a sitting Sam doll. We got an Annabelle over here. We have a Glenn doll over here. We have some other sitting Chuckies over here. Oh, a Chucky and some Tiffany's. Lots of bobbleheads and side steppers. We got Ghostface and Gremlins down here. We have Georgie. We have a Corpse Bride Scraps right here. We have a couple of them from Trick or Treat. We got Elvira and the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Sam, Chucky, Gremlins, Michael Myers, Ghostface. All right, let's come on over here and just say hello to all these guys. Hello, Cotton Candy Dan. Hello, Wanda Webworth. Hello. Oh, you're already laughing at me, sir. Okay, Nibbles, hello to you too. Hello to Barnaby the Bear. Hello, Victor and Emily. Hello, Grandma. Hello, Bobby Springs. And look, hello, Rat. All right, let's make a quick walk through the fun house of terror. I just ate, so I am not even gonna look at these mirrors. Let's leave some stickers for the scary sitting scarecrow. You're welcome, sir. Hello, Art. Hello, this guy. Hello, Tallulah. What, she, oh, she took forever to jump. What in the world? And hello, Mac Straw. Here's something I haven't seen before, the bedazzled ghost face backpack. All right, let's leave these guys some stickers here. There you go. There you go. Oh, I forgot to say hello to the gray jumping spider. Let's go ahead and leave him some stickers. Will we be getting business cards? All right, guys, wow, what an enormous store in here. There was one other thing that I was looking for and hoping to find just so that I could see it with my own eyes. Whoa, how did I miss this guy? Carrots, I knew I'd find you. Excuse me, sir, I found your best friend forever. He's right back there. So I was hoping to find the art crossbody bag just because I know that everybody's looking for it and I wanted to see it with my own two eyes. And I don't see it, but we did get to see the Art Krispies throw blanket. That is the coolest ever right there. All right, guys, that is it for the Fairlawn, Ohio Spirit Halloween. Make sure you go over to that other Nate Guys channel because he was just here filming this literally an hour ago. Oh, <laughs> my